Hello, so I'm going to just do a quick Canva tutorial because I had a few people ask about it. So um, what I love is here you can search for anything. So if you put in YouTube, it brings up um, like thumbnail or channel art. If you put in Facebook, you can do ads, you can do covers, um, Instagram, it's got uh, tons of different things. So for social media, or you can just do like a presentation if you put in present or presentation. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> they have tons of different things. You can even just search like through what they have, but um, it's really nice if you have an idea of what you want. So say we wanted to make an Instagram post. So it has the measurements already, and then they have templates you can choose from, or you can create your own. But the best part is you can like change any of your um, posts. So like once you click on it, it will open a new tab. Um, if you find one that you like and you are able to change any colors that you don't like. So you can click up here on color. You can go over here to choose, maybe I want an aqua <laughs> and you see it can change it. And then it's really easy to um, pick the colors that you want um, from, from there. And so just makes it really nice um, for you to be able to change it to different things. Um, you can make it different color, uh, I mean, lighter, darker, you get the point. I think we've <laughs> all got the point. Okay, um, and so you can um, then, of course, change the text to whatever you want it to be. Maybe say, come join me teaching online, yay. <laughs> <laughs> and then maybe you want your name or something. So I mean, really quickly, I just made a, except for now I'm like, I don't like that color. <laughs> so I don't know, whatever you wanna change it to, I mean, doesn't matter. So there's animation. So if you look over here, you can upload. So you can upload any image that you can see, family pictures, yay. <laughs> then they have photos, um, elements. This is like, uh, where if you need to find a picture of something, so say you're looking for a flower, um, here's a bunch of flowers. Now you'll see if it says pro, you either have to pay $1 to use it, or you can do up here, see how it says try Canva Pro, you can even do like a, um, a free trial for a little while. And then you can pay like a monthly subscription if you want. Um, if you're making lots of stuff, um, this is a really, really good option. But um, you can see like this one's free, so maybe I wanna add a flower. And um, so there's my flower, I've put it on now. And you can see position right here, you can move anything backwards or forwards if you want text on top of something. Because if you notice this flower was behind the text, but if I wanted it in front, I could have done that. So you can add that. So you can search for anything there, you can add text, so they have text that you can edit, or you can choose a heading, subheading, change your text, uh, your font, I mean. Um, music, you could add music to go along with it. You can put a video into your, uh, into your thing. So like maybe if I want a video, I mean, if I wanted to, I, th th this is just showing you all the things that they have. <laughs> So if I put it backwards, let's see. Okay, so that's, so you can see I'm moving it backward, backward till I get it to where I want it to be. So see, now it's there and you can press play and oh, look at how beautiful, yay. <laughs> and you can have that on your Instagram or Facebook or something like that. Next, um, you can change to background images. You can have different folders. Um, I don't have any folders, but you can create some, <laughs> create some. <laughs> So it really is um, really quite simple and easy to use, which is really, really nice. Then up here, you can see how it says download, and you can choose, since this had a video, um, if you wanted the video to play or GIF, you could have it animate that way. If I do a PDF or a JPEG or an, a PNG, then it wouldn't animate, but I mean, you can see that you can save it in all these different different types of files, which is really nice. Now, this present right here, or you can share a link, Facebook, Twitter, email. But this present is what I wanna to show to you guys. So if you've made a presentation, you can press present, and then it puts it into this nice presentation. So you can share this screen if you have like multiple presentation things to show in your class. Um, and so they do have um, 
the presentation slides that you can edit and then you can press present and share it with your class without having to even download it if you don't want to. So um, Canva is just so useful, so versatile and for it to be free, like that's amazing. But I mean the Canva Pro, definitely if you're making a lot worth your money. Um, but yes, hopefully this helps you. Um, and uh, yeah, if you have any questions, let me know.